six months. Hi. Zero Eleven here. And today, I rolled up to your best pals at Walmart for the first time since March 18th. So it's been a while. The reason why I rolled up to your best pals, because a number of you told me about this hockey gems of the game trading cards from your best pals at MJ. <laughs> holding so last time i went to the best pals to get something i think it was a rookies one where you had young guns i got like 10 young guns that was really good this one we're getting one graded rookie card and 10 factory sealed packs per box now first off we got a three thousand dollar card on the front there and then what's sid there uh, about a two thousand dollar card there it's not a true gem but it's close to it and Matthews is also a pretty valuable card, but we're guaranteed a nine or higher graded card. Ooh, and we're getting 10 packs and they show us some uh, series one and two packs, mainly series one, aside from that 1617 one there. But yeah, it's from your best pals at MJ Holding, from your best pals at Walmart. Rolled up there, no physical altercation, no casual shouting match. I actually purchased these normally. It was refreshing, but yeah, we're gonna be opening these up today. And before I continue on, these things cost $31.92. They get you for the extra $1.92. Very hostile. They've been doing that since the start of like 1920. Very freaking hostile. Frick Walmart. I hate Walmart so much. I was out of there so fast. I was power walking like crazy. <laughs> but yeah, let's open these up. Oh, well, can't find my butter knife, so. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna give MJ Holdings the benefit of the doubt. Because the last time I opened something from them, it was good. Let's do the grain card last. I feel it there. How many score packs? Before I get into this, how many? We're expecting 10. It's MJ Holding. They gotta have six score packs, right? Okay, here are some of them. Whoa, no score so far? Oh my gosh. Okay, next up. <laughs> as I say that, as I say that, right on cue. Oh my gosh. Uh, MJ Holding. You must have started out with like a million of these freaking packs or more. Gee. <laughs> but the packs, we got four of your favorite packs. Score, 12, 13. 16, 17, Series 1, that's a good pack. Austin Matthews. We got two Parkers, 18, 19. That's a pretty cheap pack. And then we got 18, 19, Series 1 and 2. So there's some good packs. And Parkers, which they have a lot of. And I can already feel the beeping thing in there. So let's open some score, yeah. Okay, score. Okay, there's score. Let's do some Parkers 1819. These are cheap packs. What are the auto odds on here? One in 480. <sighs> that's that's tough. One in 480 for an auto. Okay, looks like I got a prominent prospects. It's not gonna be an auto though. Oh, well, there it is. <laughs> yes, Barry Kutkaniemi. Prominent prospects. That's not bad at all, right there, Kutkaniemi. There we go. So yeah, I'll take it. The uh, Valamaki rookie. Bunch of sticking cards. Uh, even more sticking cards. So there is that. The parallels were so hard to tell, but uh. okay. Next pack up of eighteen ninety Parkers. Got two of these beeping thing. Did not shoplift these. Did not shoplift these. Okay, they're like freaking seventy bucks after taxes. Carlson. Yeah, there's some base from Parkhurst here, and there is a. Silver, whatever the heck you want to call this. There's Chris Tierney and Rupe Hints, rookie, OV All Star, Carter Hutton. All right, let's do Parker's 1617. Stuff I really like. I wish they kept the rookie parades instead of uh, these prominent prospects. Rookie parades are awesome. Beeping thing. This freaking box, these boxes went off twice. I just ran out of there. Okay. Don't need to check my bags, it's not necessary. Got a Henrik Sedin, red. Okay, well, yeah, there's a Parker. Evan Rodriguez, Mikhail Sergachev, rookies. Let's do the Matthews pack, because I'm just frustrated with this stuff. I've been hunting Matthews for so long to the point where I don't even want the card anymore, so. But I'll still open it every now and then. Uh, what we got here? 
Uh, Shining Stars, Corey Schneider. There we go. He's a star. Corey Schneider, Shining Stars. There you go. Abdicator, Holland, Brody. All right, let's do Series 2, 1819. Looking for Carter Hart, Svechikov, Brady Kachuk, uh, Elias Samsonov, Justin Falk, Franz Nielsen, Ryan Miller, Mike Riley, Portraits Rookies, Samuel Montembo. There you go, there's Samuel Montembo, Rookie Portraits, Carlson, Tyler Johnson, Hannafin. All right, we got 1819 Series 1. Elias is on fire right now, his stuff's on fire. We still need to get that graded card out of the box here. Getting two grade cards in this break. We'll check it out right after this. But Mike Smith, Travis Konechny, Clayton Keller. There's the Yager years. 93-94 for Yager there. Soderberg, more base. Kerfoot. Okay, let's reveal the graded card. Let's see if it's actually, like, proper. Wow, oh, it's this mass-produced crap. So it's going to be a 10 for sure because all of these are 10. Even though they're not actually 10, but... What, what the heck is this? Okay, well, it's a player I know, but... Uh, Patrick O'Sullivan, BCCG, graded in bulk. Who cares what it actually is graded? We'll just throw a 10 on it. Young Guns. So, just checking the condition of that. I mean, it looks good. It's not like a 10. There's no way. Yeah, like right there, that wouldn't get a 10. Yeah, maybe a 9.5 maybe. 607 Series 1 Young Guns. Oh, that was uh, the first box. That was pretty rough. Let's open the second one now. Also, when I went to your best pals, they had like no cards in there. They had these in there and like one Series 2 1920 Blaster. And then like maybe some MVP and that's it. Like no other sports. It's all just gone. It was pretty jarring. Okay, there's a graded card. There is whatever the heck this is. Uh, what the heck am I grabbing at here? Come on, score. There it is. Okay. All right, so here are the packs again. Four packs of score. Everybody loves... Oh, everybody loves score. We got 15, 16, Series 1, Blaster Pack. Firmly frick my bum. Uh, we got two Parkers. Uh, another... Par the... Uh, geez. Okay, well, this is mildly hostile. These are from another repack, I'm pretty sure, where you can't get jerseys, right? Yeah, the, I think these are the ones where you can't get jerseys, so. This is getting really hostile real quick. Score! Okay, now on to Parkhurst. All right, time to open the 1819 Parkhurst here. Hopefully not a stick. I'll just do that. I don't care. I'm not pulling an auto. Okay. Got a prominent prospects. Maybe it's Elias. Faxa. Taurus. McKinnon. Yeah, some base there. Christian Vessel line and prominent prospects. Still a prospect. But there's a prominent prospects. Cahoon rookie. Matthews all-star. Frickin' Zaitsev. Mark Stahl. All right. Next pack of Parkhurst. Okay. This stuff is really cheap. Okay, what the heck do we got here? We got something else shiny. What the heck is that? Different insert. Need a rider, hope be... Uh, okay, original six. Anthony Mantha. Past, present, future. He's future, okay. There's Mantha, original six. There's that. Troy Terry rookie. Yeah, okay. Do Parkhurst, 1617. Uh, Fricking beeping thing. Uh, we got a red, so there's frick all in here, so... There we go. Let's just ask him to see you. Justin frickin' Bailey Santini. Let's open this blaster pack of um, Series 1. I don't know why it's in here. Did they run out of 8-card packs? They were 1 and 4. 1 and 6 for young guys. This is just greasy AF. Oh, okay, see what we get in here. Okay, Series 2, 1819. Come on, something. Man, this is one of the greasiest repacks I've seen in a while. Great job, MJ Holding. Great job. Okay. <laughs> Firmly frick my bum. Fricking Brad. So, Amela. Um, okay, here we go. Final pack, 1819. Frickin' greasy repack here. William. All right, let's see what the graded card is. Uh, more BCCG hostile garbage. 
Man, do not buy this crap. Mike Card Young Gun, 458. Mike Card. There's a name. That card's worth like a buck. And there you go. Look at that. Clearly not a 10, but it's a 10. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's a 10. I got a graded 10 card. Look at that. It probably gets like an 8.5, but yeah, it's 10. Whoa. So yeah, yeah. There's some freaking gems of the game. Freaking hostile crap. As expected from your best pals at MMJ Holding, they're back at it again. After having a couple of really good repacks, they're back at being freaking greasy AF. That's how I know them. There's MJ Holding. What a hostile break that was. Frick that, man. I hate Walmart. So, uh, guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. Do not buy that crap. I'm telling you right now. Do you want some $1 cards that are not graded 10, but for the sake of business, they'll throw a 10 on there? Stay tuned for more breaks to come. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.